Hey everybody, it's Alex. I just wanted to share with you guys real quick that I got this mirror at the place where my antique booth is. So I really liked it there. I was walking around and I was looking to see if any of my stuff was in anyone else's booths or like the lost and found area or anything like that. See, I have this little thing here going on. Um, anyway, so I spotted the mirror and I was like, oh my gosh, I have to have that. So it, this is my hallway and right here was actually this bamboo mirror that I probably got from Goodwill, the pay by the pound Goodwill. And if they, if it was something that was too big, they wouldn't weigh it, they would charge you a dollar back then. So I bought the big mirror for a dollar. It was like this bamboo style, like back when I would decorate my house with giraffes and stuff. So it matched my like personality and things like that back then, probably a good 13 years ago maybe. Um, but I've changed a lot since then. So it didn't really kind of, you know, didn't go with, you know, um, I don't know, my house, my mindset, my, my mood, my, my everything. Um, so I took it down and I actually listed it on Facebook Marketplace and it was the first listing that I did and it actually sold. I had it up for like an hour and a half and while I was at work, I was getting people messaging me about it. So I sold it. So I, that's what the, I like to do. If I find something that I like, if I bring something in my house, I will take something away. So anyways, I just wanted to share that mirror with you. Hey everybody, it's Alex. I am back with another Salvation Army Hall half off day. Um, I was kind of, again, annoyed with the prices that were coming out of the, you know, when they were wheeling the bins out. So I was kind of choosy, even though it doesn't look like I was really choosy because I have a bunch of stuff, but I did put a bunch of stuff back. And I do, like try and negotiate with the the people like the one one of the guys is really cool that always wheels the things out i'm like listen this was here last week when i was here and it still hasn't sold do you think you could do any less and he's like oh sure because they he wants to sell it you know but anyways this is the stuff that i found and let me just show you so i thought these were really cool um they say Oh, maybe it was the other one that said so you could read better. Yeah. Can you see that? I don't know. There you go. Something made in England. Peck garage? Peck, yeah, I don't know how you pronounce that. But these are like little brass doohickeys that you'd hang on the wall with ships. Well, they're not even all brass because there's a little chip right there. So you can see it's not, you know, it's just like a plating of it or whatever, but still cool. 49 cents. So that was a cool deal. Um, then I found this, like, I've seen quite a few people find these, these little, almost looks like a treasure, treasure chest, little jewelry box. They're from like the seventies. Um, it was $4 half off, but I think a lot of things I don't repaint, but sometimes I do because... I don't know, I just like it better. So sometimes I just leave it with its integrity. Sometimes I'm like, nope, we gotta give you a makeover. So this one I think I will give a makeover. Oh, that was loud. Yeah, it's kind of seen better days. We'll fancy it up a little bit and make it look better. It's cool, it's got like lion hardware. Really neat. Okay, so that was that. Then I found this guy, and I wasn't going to get him, though I, I, if you guys watched me before, you know I've told you I've sold broken clocks, because there's people that are just clock collectors. But I looked this up, and it is a vintage piece, the metal, the all metal kind of gave it away for me, but I had to be sure. So I looked it up, and it is. It was two bucks, but it doesn't work, and I did see some that didn't sell on eBay. I mean, I mean that didn't work, that sold. There you go. But, yeah, they probably wound it too tight. That's usually the case. But, yeah, so I got that. Then I got this little Betsy Johnson purse. It was 99 cents. It looks good. Let's see if I could do this one hand. It has the little thing there. And her signature, like, black floral stuff in there. So that was a good deal, I think. 
found this thing. Okay, so there was quite a few cool vases. And um, I mentioned this before. If I, if I don't get it out of their carts that they're bringing out on the shelves, everything's color coordinated. So they had quite a few cool, like, black vases. This one, I don't It's probably just someone's, like, homemade thing, but that's what it says on the bottom. Um, it was $2.50, but I thought... I can't tell if that's, like, Art deco -y or 80s. <laughs> you know, it's, like, too big time span of a gap. But, um, I don't know. I just thought it was neat. And bonus, it came with this little flower frog. This little mini guy in there. So, two bucks. So, I think, I don't know, a dollar a piece. Pretty cool. So, I got that. And then I got this Oldsmobile by Syracuse China. It's Oldsmobile on the front. Um, when I looked it up, I was like, what is it supposed to be? Um, my mom had a good idea. She thought maybe, you know, when you'd go to the restaurants and they have the little thing for the, um, like, like sugar packets and stuff. She was thinking maybe that, I don't know if they would have done, I, that's kind of really small to be like a soup or if that was just a sugar dish or something. But anyways, I saw a coffee cup and, and saucer sold for a hundred dollars. So this is 49 cents. So that works for me. We're going to give it a go. Then let's see up here. I got this cool like black stool thing. I'm going to clean that up and I'll just keep that with my stuff. Um, these are neat. These were 99 cents at half off. They say made in Greece on the back. But they're these little, that like red felt, these little coasters. Really neat. This was the how it really was like that on top. And that's how I saw it. And I was like, I bet those are cool. So I got those. Then I got this little trinket dish. I don't know. I liked the green. The the That kind of felt dates it for me. You know, you know, makes it, it's not really new. It's not, you know what I'm trying to say. So it was 99 cents. It was pretty cool. Um, I was iffy about this, but I got it anyway because it was 99 cents. And here's what it says on the bottom. I haven't looked it up yet. So if anybody knows anything about that, let me know. So I finished paying for my stuff, right? And I went out to my car, but I was like, oh, let me go to the restroom because it's like a good 20, 25 minutes on, my, on the way home. So I go back in and they, of course, brought out, um... They brought out more stuff and I grabbed a couple things, but this is the one thing that I grabbed that nobody wanted. Like everyone put it back and I was like, are you kidding me? Those koi fish and that pink color. Mm -hmm. So it was $1.50. Really cool. I love that. Okay. So I showed all that and then there was these and I always look for this pink depression glass and it doesn't say France anywhere. So I know it's not the... French one, but they were $2.50. This smaller one has a chip right here, like a pretty nice size chip. But look, they have like the little handles and everything, like really cute little mixing bowls. But I grabbed them because my, uh, well, it's my mom's sister-in-law. Her daughter collects pink depression glass. So I collect it for her and then for Christmas she gives it to her her daughter so I got that let me put that over here this gaudy awful oh my gosh it's gaudy but I love it I hate the flowers but that what is that a swan it is ridiculous I love it it is so heavy on the bottom it says well it's upside down and it says made in Taiwan, Republic of China. So this is a beast, you guys. Okay. So then, I don't know. I got home and I was like, why did I get this? Because I'm a sucker for a cloche. But I don't know. It was $2.50. If, if it would have been like $1.99, then I would be like, okay. But it's a music box, so we'll see. It makes music made in Taiwan, so it's older. This thing was cool. I thought it was different when I saw it in the cart and nobody wanted it. 
So I looked it up and it turns out it's like Czech glass, you know, from the Czech Republic. I forget the designer's name. That would help. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't have, I don't remember. I was looking it up real quick, but, um, and I forget the pattern name, but it is Czech glass. So apparently it's something interesting and it was 250. So we're going to see what that does. Then I found these cute little swanky swig glasses. Aren't they so cute? For 49 cents a piece. And then I got this guy. I haven't looked him up yet. It's kind of interesting. I liked the label on the bottom, so that's what I'm going to look up. French Chef Gourmet Cookware Microwave Safe and Oven Proof. So, yeah. I'm going to look him up. It's dollar fifty. And then this is that um, Staffordshire... Am I remembering that correct? Piece. It says made in England, but when I looked them up, that's what it said. About 30 bucks sold. Some sold listings on eBay, so that was $1.50. Then this. I had these masks in my room when I was younger. My mom had all kinds of masks for me in my room. This one was just so unique. It was like a mask wearing a cat mask. And it has like this big old little... Big old little chip. That's what I'm going to go with. And it says clay art on the back. But oh my gosh. It was just so interesting. Like so different. That I thought. You know. Maybe someone could live with that. And there's another little one right there. I don't know. Oh. And then I just saw that. Like someone tried to cover color that in on the ear. I don't know. We'll see. 250 If not. I bet you. Like my daughter would like it. And I was super excited to find this. It's a little flosser. Um, my son accidentally knocked his into the trash and instead of just taking it out and like washing it off, he left it there because he thought it was gross. And they're like three, four bucks at the store. So I'm glad I got it for 49 cents. Then I got this, this is by Teleflora, but it's from 83. So, and people like strawberries, they like enamel. So we'll go with it, it was $1.50 or $1.49. Then, okay, so I got, this was originally a 1999 elephant, okay? Um, I showed one of the girls there that this thing was 1999, and she's like, oh yeah, I had that in my cart the other day, but I wasn't going to get it for 1999. I'm like, this is the thing I was talking about. I was like, oh, it's been here a while? And she says, yeah. So I went and asked the man, I was telling him that this was here the other day, you know, um, I mentioned the girl who was going to get it and he was like, yeah, take it here. And he went and got a, his price gun and that's what he priced it. So I was so excited to get that for $1.49. I know the trunk is down, but it's really interesting looking with the guy riding on top. So we'll see how that goes. But I was glad to get that reduced so I can get that. Um, I got these two older um, yardsticks. And they were 49 cents each. Then I got these really cool horns. That one looks like it was smushed a little bit. This one was two bucks, but it'd be cool decoration, right? This one was 250. Big old thing. I bet that'd be a cool wreath. You can make that into a wreath or something. So those were those. And then this was like so exciting look at this thing I don't even know what this is but those little starbursts and the gold scream 50s to me it's um hold on let me try and do this here ooh, ooh, ooh. it's like has this silver on the back I paid five bucks for this so yes yeah, like this big glass tray all right and then my last thing is this it's gonna be for me um, I paid three bucks for it. It's a silver plated little tray with footed, well, no, not footed feet, with feet. <laughs> so that's everything I got today, guys. Um, yeah, I do have actually a haul that I was waiting to do, but my husband's been home the last few days and I'm just like, no, I'll wait till you're gone to do a haul video. So he's not home at the moment. So I figured, oh, let me get my stuff. But um, yeah, I have some other stuff that I'll share with you guys in another video. So thanks so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys again soon.
Bye. I totally forgot this. Ooh, shadow. I got this today too at the Salvation Army. It, I took the price sticker off. It was originally $5.99 and I got it for three, so $2.99. There, it's a really big piece actually. Um, their wall art doesn't sell very well for them, so they price it pretty cheap. Now, if it's a mirror, good luck. They're kind of expensive. <laughs> but um, yeah, it's signed, and on the back, I want to say it said it was dated like 1983 or something like that. But it was drawn or painted to look older, and the frame is real nice. It's like a real, you know, like shabby chic type frame. So yeah, I got that too, and that one was for me.